Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make a zoom out through wheel transition effect in After Effects. First of all let's scroll to our second layer with a wheel clip and then duplicate it. Make sure you are at the very beginning of that layer. Then right click on it, go to time and select freeze frame. Now go 40 frames backward, hold shift and press page up 4 times on your keyboard. Let's move that froze layer there and then cut the ending where the second actual clip starts from. Let's pre-compose frozen layer now. I will name it wheel and then make sure move all attributes and adjust composition duration is selected and then hit OK. So now we have to mask the wheel, you can use After Effects masking tools or a Mocha AE like me. In case if you mask in Mocha, make sure to click on save and then close Mocha AE. Then expand matte and click on create AE masks. Nice, since we have that clean masked wheel layer, we have to duplicate wheel layer, then select bottom one and rename it to zoom out. Now press M on your keyboard to open masks on zoom out layer and make sure to change mask mode to subtract. Before we will make a zooming effect, first let's animate the wheel, select wheel layer and scroll to the end of it, then press S on your keyboard to open scale. Now let's click on scale stopwatch icon to create a keyframe, then scroll back something like that and change scale to 0%. If you play back the video, you will see that the wheel is animated and it scales in, so now let's make a zooming out effect. Go to layer, then new and select camera. I will name it to zoom out and change preset to 28mm and then hit OK. Cut camera layer and match it to wheel layer. Now select zoom out layer and make sure to enable 3D on it, then expand camera settings. Then transform and make sure to scroll to the end of the camera layer and then click on point of interest and position stopwatch icons. Now press U on your keyboard to see only created keyframes. Then scroll to the very beginning of camera layer and let's grab a dolly cursor tool and make sure to zoom all in the wheel like this. Now let's select all keyframes and hit F9 on your keyboard to easy ease them, then go to graph editor, right click there and select edit speed graph. Now make a smooth curve like mine, or play around with the curve until you will be satisfied with it. Let's check it. Once you are happy with it, close graph editor and make sure to enable motion blur on wheel and zoom out layers. That looks way smoother. Let's add some shakes now. I will skip shakes part because I have made too much shake tutorials. Also I have made 16 unique shake presets that you can get from the link in description. Check how it looks like with my shake presets. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.